Hey everyone, it's Ivan with KitBadger.com, here to bring you another gear review. I'm here with my two assistants. Who are you guys? Jada, Ira. Jada and Ira. And we are talking about what? Sleeping bags. Sleeping yes, bags. we are. Sleeping bags. These in particular, which are the Spike Lake by Big Agnes. So where did you guys get these sleeping bags? Santa. From Santa. You did get them from Santa. And are they cozy and warm? Yeah. yeah. They are pretty cozy and warm. Did you guys know I actually used one of them on my last backpacking trip? Really? I did. I was up backpacking in the snow, sleeping on snow, and it actually kept me really nice and toasty. I was uh, quite pleased. These Spike Lake are rated down to 15 degrees, and they're actually filled with a down tech material, which is a 600 fill down, and it is treated with something that may as well be magic that keeps it from clumping if it does start to get wet like traditional down so should you accidentally get this thing all wet it'll still actually insulate you some versus your traditional down bag both these bags for my boys they're both regular size good for about up to about six feet i guess plenty of room to grow into them and they also have a long version which is good to about six foot six difference in weight about 2.10 ounces for the regular versus 2.13 for the long. And compression, about 8x8 eight eight or 8x9 eight for the long. Again, a little bit bigger. Some of the nice things about these Big Agnes bags, this, for one, is one of their traditional mummy bags. And inside, you have this collar right here. And this thing is actually really awesome. I appreciate it when I used it. Once you have it all zipped up and that collar's there, it keeps any draft from coming down and robbing you of any heat. As far as other little features on here too, you got good YKK zippers that are gonna actually hold up and last. And you have a number of these little lash points where unzip this thing, the way I use them anyway. So I'll unzip it and I'll hang it by these out in the sun. Cause I don't wanna wash this thing every time my boys use it unless they're really dirty. So basically unzip it, hang it up, get it in the sun, let that UV light kill all the bad stuff. The liner on the Spike Lake is this nylon taffeta. I think that's how it's pronounced. No idea what that means, but I will say it's actually pretty cozy. On the outside, this outer shell, it's this breathable shell made of this ripstop nylon, which is really nice because if you get a little hole in this, you don't want it to turn into a massive celebration of down feathers. So if there is a little hole, it's gonna stay little and give you time to actually patch it, sew it up, something along those lines. Also, this is coated and it's water resistant. Don't wanna celebrate it, but if you're in the tent, spill your Nalgene or something, brush it off. You're not gonna have a completely soaked bag if you just get some water on this guy. Another feature of these Spike Lake bags that I do like is they're just mummy bags. Big Agnes has an entire line of sleeping bags, which use a proprietary sleeping pad to actually reach the rating level, in this instance, 15 degrees. These are not. Any sleeping pad, you're good to go. I do like that. When you get these, they're gonna come with two things. They're gonna have a stuff sack, not a compression sack, but a stuff sack. And they're also gonna have a big mesh bag. So anytime you're not gonna be actively using this or need it compressed, you just keep it in the big mesh bag and that way all your down isn't getting compressed and it'll extend the life of your bags. Price point, pretty good deal on these bags. These being their regular, they run about 200 bucks. If you want the long, little extra length, runs about 210 bucks. Great bags, expect to get a lot of use out of these as these guys grow up and we go on more and more adventures. As always, thanks for joining us at kitbadger.com. Look forward to seeing you next time.